Have you ever thought about the numbers that narrate our online stories? Interested in the statistical side of our digital journey as we celebrate one year in business? Join me as we explore these questions in today's episode of Mr. Mark's Math Adventures. Hey math learners, Mr. Marks here, your friendly neighborhood math teacher. Remember, it's not just about getting the right answers. It's about learning and growing along the way. Now, before we dive into today's adventure, remember to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to stay tuned for future episodes. Now today, we're celebrating a very special occasion. First anniversary of all things Mr. Marks. And what better way to commemorate this milestone than with the language of the universe, mathematics. Now, on our journey this year, we've gathered incredible data across different platforms. And today, we're diving into this data with math. Let's start with our website analytics on Squarespace. Now, as we get started, always feel free to use the companion worksheet. It's a great tool to follow along with the episode and to reinforce your learning. Companion worksheet is free to download, link down in the description. Now, over this year, our site has attracted over 2,400 unique visitors. Now, let's take a look over at YouTube. Wow, we have had over 241,000 views and gained over 40,000 subscribers. Our most popular video on exponents in parentheses is at over 60,000 views. Now on TikTok, we have mathed our way to over 4,800 likes and welcomed over 4,000 new followers. Our star episode even reached over 50 shares and 1,500 likes. And on Instagram, we grew by 625 followers. And on Facebook, we added over 200 new likes. Isn't it amazing to use numbers to see how our digital family is expanding? Now, using our growth formula, we find that our YouTube subscriber growth is, well, technically infinite. That's because we started from zero. Wait, what does that even mean? It's a curious mathematical conundrum, isn't it? We will explore this intriguing concept in a future episode. But let's actually pause for just a quick moment and ponder this idea of infinite growth because we're essentially going from nothing to something. It's like if you had zero cookies and then you suddenly find yourself with one single cookie, that's an infinite increase in cookies. While infinite growth sounds vast, it simply means we've started our journey from the ground up. Hey, in a year from now, these growth numbers will be a whole different story. Maybe we'll get lucky and get to see some exponential growth patterns. And that's a wrap. As today's math adventure comes to a close, I want to express my deepest gratitude to each and every one of you. Hey, props to you for taking some time out of your day to do some math with me. I hope you followed along, and if you made mistakes, that's all good. Remember that every mistake is a step towards learning something new. And hey, Mr. Mark's Math Adventures is holding a giveaway. Click the link down in the description to see all the giveaway details and for your chance to win. This is Mr. Mark signing off. I'll catch you next time with another math problem. What did you think? Did you approach this problem differently? Let me know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this problem, show your support by liking and sharing this video. And don't forget to follow my page to stay up to date on more math-related content. Until next time, 